Hey, it is Vicki. I am reading today from Each Day a New Beginning, and it's from October 21st. The strength of the drive determines the force required to suppress it. Mary Jane Shurfee. We are all struggling to succeed, and each day of our lives will be confronted with major or minor adversities that might well interfere with our success. Adversities don't have to hinder us, however. They can strengthen us if we incorporate them as opportunities for growth. For many of us, the ability to handle adversity is a fairly recent phenomenon, and not always can we do it securely and with ease. But we are coming to believe that a power greater than ourselves is at hand and we will guarantee and will guarantee us all the strength we'll ever need. Knowing that action is always possible, the passive acceptance of any condition need never be necessary, our unconditional gifts of living the 12-step program. Our path forward is as certain as our commitment to it, our belief in the strength of the program and our faith that all is well even when times are troubled. No one ever promised that our new way of life would be always easy, but we have been promised that we'll arrive at our proper destination if we do the footwork and let God do the navigating. Success is at hand. I will apply what I'm learning and I'll meet it. It's a good one, and it um, and it's proving to be true right right this minute in my life. For uh, it's it's that that action meets faith. That doing the next right thing, doing the work that it takes to get through whatever the challenge might be, to get through the, the struggle or the uncomfortable um, with a faith that this is getting me somewhere else, that this is a stepping stone, that whatever I'm learning is going to help me somehow down the road. And I've just been doing that one day at a time and I mean, this almost makes me cry. Our path forward is as certain as our commitment to it, our belief in the strength of the program, and our faith that all is well, even when times are troubled. No one ever promised that our new way of life would always be easy, but we have been promised that we'll arrive at the proper destination. And, you know, fundamentally, my life is, is good. But it's a challenge, and 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 there's 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 work that I'm doing, and it's big work, and it's and it's fun work, and it's it's creative and exciting, and it's also frightening. Um, it's a step out of my norm, and what this is telling me is just keep taking that action, and I'll get to the proper destination if I trust that that God is higher power and the divine and goddess and whoever it is this higher power that's been guiding me and pulling me and showing me the way is um is helping me and everybody else that we all have our own higher power and it says knowing that action is always possible that passive acceptance of any condition need never be necessary or unconditional gifts of living the 12-step program. And whether you work a 12-step program or not, taking action with your life and moving through the uncomfort and the pain and the struggle, because we all have it. We all have busy and wild and uncomfortable and crazy and just knowing that this is a growth opportunity isn't sometimes fun, and it doesn't mean you have to like it. But knowing that you can get through it with, with a good attitude, with some reliance on something that you know that things are going to come to a, a, a good way. You know, my friend in the program calls it an AFCO. Another friggin', we usually don't say friggin', 
growth opportunity, another friggin' growth opportunity. And though it's not fun, it usually catapults you somewhere better. And, and that's what this whole journey for me has been since I started doing this work. And I'm just grateful that I'm, I'm, I'm doing it and that I'm able to share the journey and learn from other people and keep my mind open. And, you know, because I used to just kind of work really hard and I kind of had an idea of what I was going to be and it was very safe and uncomfortable. I didn't like it. And now it's very uncertain, but it's kind of an adventure and it's, un, it's, it's uncharted, but it's also guided. Like I, 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 it's so bizarre. I feel so guided and, and I feel so much connection to all this stuff that I've learned all these years. It's actually like, it's actually happening inside of me. So I guess it is progress, not perfection, and I guess it is practice takes you there. So I'm just going to keep staying on this road and working these 12 steps and, and, and learning and growing and, and taking the AFCOs for what they are and, and not being scared about it. Just having more faith than fear. I hope you have a beautiful day and a beautiful week, and I will be back again tomorrow. Peace.